My name is Maggie Ford Danielson, and I'm the Global Beauty Authority for Benefit Cosmetics. Have you guys heard of this little nugget right here? Their Real Push-Up Liner? Well, it is the newest and the best innovation in the world of eyeliners. But, just like every other new technology, there's a bit of a learning curve. When I got this home, it took me a few tries to get it right, but once I did, I am obsessed with it. And I want you guys to love it just as much as I do. So, I wanted to share with you my top tips and tricks. Let's get started. All right, so you heard about their real liner. You bought it, you got it home. How do you get started? Well, the first thing you do is you take it out of the box. Ta-da! Take the top, unscrew it, and you'll see right away that there is an orange protector at the top. What do you do with that? You do this, boop, you throw it away. Now, the thing about this innovative technology is that the gel is nestled deep within this pen. We need to prime the pen and get the gel up to the top. In order to do that, you wanna spin the base of the pen a full eight to 10 times. This is the only time you'll have to prep the pen the very first time you get it home. Look, the gel has arrived. You see that amount? That is way too much for both eyes. So it's really simple. You just wipe the whole thing off. You wanna clean it up. That's how much gel you're gonna wipe off the very first time you prime this pen. Now one last thing you have to do, one click on the bottom of the pen. That will dispense the perfect amount of formula for your eyes. Let's talk about daily use with this liner. This is a gel, so when it's exposed to air, it'll get a little bit dry. All you have to do is wipe the tip, give it one click, and you're ready to rock and roll. If we're being honest with each other, I've got something to share. I have really oily eyelids. It's like a slip and slide up there. Everything just whoop, slips right off. So with this liner, what I found to work the best for me is if I prep my eyelid with a powder eyeshadow. That way, the liner doesn't budge or smudge. Some of the most amazing innovations of this eyeliner are also what take a little bit of practice. So I'm gonna apply it to myself and show you what works best for me. With this liner, it's all about the hold and the pressure. See how the sides of the pen are squared off? We did this so that it would fit ergonomically in your hand from any angle, whether you're a lefty or a righty. So hold it as you would a pencil and remember to keep the angled tip flush to the surface of your skin. The pressure you use to apply the liner is key to getting the best possible line. The more pressure you put on the tip, the thicker the line. So in order to have a thin line, use a delicate touch. Want a thicker line? Then press down with some authority. Think of the tip of the pen as the toe and the flat surface as the heel. For a thin line, use just the toe. And for a thicker line, use the heel. Now let's put a wing on it. Use your nose as a guide and then mirror the angle of your lower lashes to then stamp the wing. The Acuflex tip is the exact right shape to do this. Then simply fill it in from the top and you're done. One of the best things about their real liner is it's designed to be budge proof and smudge proof. Heck, I've even flown from Hong Kong to San Francisco and my liner stayed put. I'm gonna show you the long wearability of this eyeliner. So I have the eyeliner here in my hand. Now I'm gonna spray my hand and watch this. Look, nothing came off. But eventually you're gonna to have to take off this liner, am I right? So how you do that is I like to use their real remover. And what I do is I dispense a small amount and I just gently massage it into the product. I go back in with a moist cotton pad and simply remove it. Thanks so much. I really hope that you got some great tips and tricks on how to use their real liner and that you learn to love it just as much as I do. Thanks.